Hello, this is the Backyard Farmer and in this video I will be sharing how you can be successful in the quail business. So many people have been asking how do I start keeping quails and they've received many tips and they've been given solutions and they've just started out um, and they're wondering but how can I make this big? So this video is actually especially for those who are interested in doing quail farming as a business. So let's get started. Number one, do not make it complicated. You can try DIY initiatives, building your own shelters or making feeders and drinkers. Beginners often make the mistake of investing so much amounts of money into buying expensive equipment or creating expensive infrastructure. It is not necessary. All you need to do is get the basic information that you need and you're ready to go. You have to understand that numbers do matter in the quail business. Imagine keeping 10 quails versus keeping 1000 quails. Sometimes, if not always, you will use the same amount of fuel to transport 10 quills to the market as you would use to transport a thousand quills to the market. So I would advise anyone who is planning on keeping quills for business sake to start with at least a minimum of 200 birds. And number three, make your own feed. I believe that making your own feed will help cut down on some costs and it will also give you the opportunity to add more nutritional value to the feed that you're giving your quills. So if you have a piece of land or you can access some piece of land, plant your own maize which you can use for feed and you can also ask um, a local nutritionist on a formula for your feed and you're good to go. And fourthly, invest in an incubator. Now, an incubator is going to be a game changer for you because every time that your quails lay eggs, you're able to incubate those eggs and you're going to have a cycle of quails, quails at chick stage, quails at adult stage, quails laying eggs, and your supply is going to be endless. You won't have to spend so much money buying chicks or so much money buying um, already grown parent stock. All you can do is purchase eggs or just pick eggs that are already been laid by the quills you have and put them in your incubator. Another sure way of being successful in the quail business is not only depending on your quills for meat, but you can also use your quills for egg production and also production of chicks, meaning you will be receiving revenue from all these three sources. Number six, value addition. Things like pickled eggs or smoked quails, just anything you can do to what you already have to add value to it. And finally, branding. You want people to know about you and what you do, the products and services that you offer. So make sure that your packaging is colorful and you have a catchy name for your products and services. Hey, thanks for watching this video and I hope that these tips have been helpful. Do remember to subscribe to this channel, like and share. I'd also love to hear from you, so don't forget to comment. All the best in your quail business.